What's up guys, this is Tampa Tech and I'm gonna show you how to set up a projector and a screen and connect it to your phone so you can watch movies from your phone on the projector onto the screen. This is a great setup for an outdoor a barbecue or any kind of event that you're having. So let's go ahead and just get started. Of course, all the links will be in the video description below. If you're interested in any of these products, those links support the channel. So this is a LED projector. It supports resolutions up to 1080p and everything in this video is about a hundred dollars. The screen is, I believe, uh, 50 to 55 dollars, depending on what time of year you buy the screen. This projector is 60 dollars. So this is an LED projector. They are great because you don't have to keep on changing out the bulb. So it comes with the remote. Great. Uh, it has this little AV adapter. That's good if you want to connect. Uh, VCR maybe, you want to watch some old memories back in the day, you want to hook up your VCR, you can do so. It has this, uh, what is this, a foot? Probably a foot or something. And this is the power cord. And oh, pretty generous. $60 projector that comes with an HDMI cable, that's very generous. You don't see that. Sometimes you, when you buy a $1,000 projector, you don't get an HDMI cable. It's actually a pretty nice looking projector. It's small too. I remember the projectors back in the day. Oh my God, they were like a tank. You need like two people to hold them. They're huge. And that was in like, I think in the 90s. Of course, over the years, they got smaller. So this is a very nice looking projector. Look at that. This is a very nice looking projector. Pretty impressed. Look at that. These are all the inputs right here. Here's the AV right here. You plug that in. There's a headphone jack back there. And there's an HDMI port right there. Down here is your adjustments for your lens. This is the keystone. And this is the focus adjustment. This is the IR sensor for the remote. It supports USB and SD cards. You can plug in your computer if it has this port. And it has a TV input as well, which is really handy. This is actually the height adjustment. So let's go ahead and do that. This is really easy to set up. And there's your lens. So right now it's in standby mode. You can see the red light and you have all your buttons. So if you don't have the remote, you could press all those buttons to access whatever setting you need. So we're going to turn it on and this will turn blue. So right now the light is blue. If you can see that it's warming up. It's pretty quiet actually. So we're going to be using this adapter is the type C to HDMI is the MHL adapter made by Amazon. There's three types of MHL cables, type C, micro USB, and lightning to HDMI. I'll leave links below. You can just simply plug it in and then hook up the HDMI cable. and plug it in the back. There's the remote. Takes two AAA batteries. Now make sure your phone supports MHL. If it doesn't, this is not going to work. Now we're gonna set up the screen. The reason why I bought this particular uh, screen, well one, is the price, can't go wrong, and two, it's portable. It has this handle right here, very easy to carry around, easy to set up, easy to take down. And it's a 100 inch screen, which is great. So what you wanna do is you wanna press this button and the screen is going to drop. This part of the screen is going to drop. And you wanna face it where the feet are facing downward. So here's the feet right here. And of course you wanna set that down to the floor. And you wanna press the button first. So once you press this button, this is going to drop. Okay. Next, you want to spin where the screen is going to go upward. So we're going to open up the legs. 
you want to press this button again and then lift it up and then it'll lock into place then you want to spin it around make sure you don't knock anything over all right I want to go ahead and press this button right here and then we're going to lower the extended bar Make sure you hold on to this bar because it'll drop down real fast and hit you in the finger. All right, and then we're gonna attach it. So now it's hooked on. Let's go ahead and spin it around. Now you want to press the button and extend the screen upward. And if you want to drop the screen down, you press the button on the bottom um, handle and then you pull down. So my phone is a Samsung S9. It is M. HL compatible with the MHL adapter this is a type C to HDMI and I plugged in the HDMI cable to the projector and then I changed the input to HDMI the projector is 1080p and it supports up to 1080p so it should work fine my screen however resolution on this is 1440p but it down it goes down to 1080p when you plug this adapter in. Uh, next, you want to swipe down and you'll see a notification right here, screen mirroring. Select that and then you should see it on the screen. There it is. Now, you raise the volume, you press this arrow and hold. But I do highly recommend getting a Bluetooth speaker and then plug it into the 3.5 millimeter headphone jack hit the menu button and then go down to reduce display and you can shrink it or make it larger now if you want to make it larger of course you have to pull the projector further back and you can change to vivid the aspect ratio noise reduction if you have any noise in the picture it has that uh, you can flip it rear uh, ceiling mounted so a lot of options as you can see at night it looks amazing and for a six dollar projector this is a really great deal now I'm going to show you how to take down the screen really easy to do with the projector you just don't want to unplug it you want to turn it off using the remote so you press the power button twice on the remote and it turns off. Right here, you want to push the button down, but grab onto the bar so it doesn't fall down. All right, and then you can unhook it right here. This peg right here goes right into this hole. You have to line it up. We're gonna raise this bar, just push the button and raise it and always be cautious of your surroundings because you're gonna hit someone easily with this projector screen all right so that's the highest it goes and then you want to locate that hole and then we're going to spin it so it's facing toward the peg push this button now right here and it's going to drop this screen and then you want to line it up to put that peg And now it is locked in pretty good. And then we're done. And then just close up the legs. And then you're ready to go. So that's how you connect your phone to a projector to watch movies on a big screen. Or you could connect your phone to do presentations. If you're interested in that, this video will help hopefully helped you out. If you did, give me a thumbs up. If you know anyone that this video will help, 
click on that share button below and share this video to them, help someone out. Of course, the projector, the screen, and the and, uh, MHL cable will be in the links in the video description below. If you want more tech videos coming your way, subscribe to Tampa Tech, click on the subscribe button down below, and hit that bell notification to stay updated on the latest videos.